Hey, Typical Joel here with the Huntsman's Path Jaeger Task Guide for you guys. I hope you're having a good day and let's get into it. So here we had just spawned and I was going to go to New Gas to check out if we could see if Rishal was there to kill him for my task. And then we seen this one guy. Well, then I seen that guy at the end, so I killed him, obviously. Homie got shot at and didn't know where he was getting shot at from. And then we realized it was Sniper Scav. Killed him too. And after that, basically just started to go to the new gas. Just checking right there and right here before we went in just so we don't get killed. Hit this stash up real quick. Grabbing everything to make money just in case we don't see anyone. See another scab, we killed him. We didn't know if it was Rashala and his boys or not. Heard that fighting. Uh, my buddy was shooting at a scab in the back. He's kind of a Timmy, so we were wondering if Rashala was here. Once I seen that he only had this. I kind of knew that Rashal wasn't here, but Buddy was like, oh, make sure you check around back. There's still some scav. So I ran around, went and checked, but he had already went in to go and kill the scav. Started to go back towards dorms. Started to make our way to dorms. Right here, I'm just checking dorms third story and second story to see if I could see anyone inside. And it uh, didn't look like there was anyone there, so we started pushing up. Heard this gap to my left, killed him with the first shot. Then right here, I was like, oh, he's not going to be here. He's never here. And when is he ever here? It was at that moment that I knew I was going to kill Rashala. Then my buddy told me where he was, and I wasn't stopping. I was going. I was getting my task done. And this is it, boys. just gotta push and hold the good angles when you're fighting bosses and guards because they they usually have good ammo and usually tap you once and right here I went around to make sure that I would got the drop on him homie had cleared left side already and made sure no one was there I had to check right side to make sure it was all clear because they had told me that he would be on my right I know they sit in there same with scab boss sometimes so I just knew he was there to the left That guy too. Went to run out the door, my buddy was there. And I realized that homie would be there too, so I quick checked. Killed him. And there you go, boys. That's how you kill the guards and kill Rashala. And get that task done. The hardest part about this task, I would say, is the fact that I can barely find him. And when I do find him, I'm either on a scab run or I have no kit on. I'm just running in like hatchet run or knife run you know what I mean at this point I was just ready to get the loot and get out so I got everything I could tried to give all um, right here I was trying to figure out what to do with these fast years my buddy wanted him the Timmy Timmy in our group so I, I gave him to him to help him out got all the loot I could get and dipped out luckily we had smugglers boat for extract always check if the fire is on because that's a really quick PMC extract away from dorms if car is not there that was a nice quick and easy raid and just wanted to show you guys how I did it
just sold everything. Sold everything to Mechanic for $111,000. Completed the Huntsman Path Trophy task. Got all the shit from that and I put it all on flea because on flea if you have multiples of things you usually get a better end price for everything. Sold everything else to therapist and then I realized that's probably going to be more money on flea so I sold the plexiglass on flea market as well. Same with the green and red gunpowder they can always be sold on flea market for a decent price more like 15,000 more than you can sell them to therapist for. After that, I received all my money off of flea market for the stuff I sold. Got like $300,000 off that raid. And completed the task I've been stuck on for weeks.